Okay, so this is going to be video response to uh, Pipe Friend CHS. I don't know his name and Pipe Friend. Uh, if you get this video, tell me what your first name is so I can start calling you by your first name. Unless, of course, it's so private. So, anyway, as I was saying, Pipe Friend CHS got his first cigar. Congratulations, Pipe Friend. Um, I've been waiting for this video that you've been talking about getting a cigar for a long time. I don't want to make this video too long, but uh, I am uh, just started smoking cigars myself um, not too long ago, actually. Well, I'd say about eight, eight or nine months ago, less than a year ago. So I thought it might be best time uh, for me to try it out. So um, I've got a box here. I've got one left in here. This is just a cheap one, but um, I thought it might be perfect to... Uh, Check this one out. These are just little cheapies, but um, anyway, there it is. Aroma smells good. What was I gonna say? There's something I was gonna say um, before the video started. Uh, um, why I prefer pipes over cigars? Well, pipes are still more convenient. Um, you know, you could with a pipe you can adjust how much you smoke, whereas cigar once you light it up. You know, you're pretty well committed. I mean, you could put it out and relight it, but it just doesn't taste the same. Whereas a, uh, a, a pipe, for those of you who are thinking about it, you know, you could adjust how much you smoke. If you just want 15 or 20 minutes worth, well, you just don't put that much in the bowl. You just don't fill it up. But, um, I'm trying to remove the paper on this, and it's not working. Okay. Well, if it comes with this paper, don't remove it because it'll tear off the um, the leaf around it. Anyway, if you see, sometimes they have that pipe friend and whoever else. Sometimes, if you get them, they have it pre-cut right there. But if you don't... Oh, where's my tool? Hang on, guys. Yeah, you, you could get that snipper. Or what I got was this little, uh, you know, it's like a buck. You can get them. All it does is it, is it cuts a hole right right there in the center. So I don't know if that's picking up on camera. Let me see if I can get around here so I can see it. Okay. Yeah, all, all, all it does is cut a hole right there. You just twist it and it pops out. And in there, uh, you just pop out that little piece. So it's a great little cheap little thing you know it's good to have one there they cost only a buck or two to put them in your pocket they're small so they're easy to lose so you know no big deal I haven't tried this one yet but again it's a it's a four dollar cigar so it's a cheap one but I'm gonna light it right here and, uh, the aroma is nice so uh, here we go now pipe friend and others I know a lot of you use um, lighters to light your cigars traditionally you're not supposed to use the lighter and it does not pack the flavor I was watching um, what was I watching Superman Returns and Lex Luthor lit his cigar with a torch blow lighter torch lighter I wouldn't recommend that I don't recommend lighter lighters at all good old-fashioned matches I say work the best and are actually more traditional so Pipe Friend CHS how you lit yours that is correct what you do is you um, rotate around so you get an even uh, toasting otherwise when it starts to burn it will burn crooked so here it goes scared the heck out of me try to get a little bit closer here There it is. If you guys have any questions, by the way, this is Dominican Republic. Someone was telling me that uh, Cuban cigars now are legal. I don't know that they lifted the ban. So I don't know if that's true. If anyone knows if that's true out there, leave me a comment. Let me know because I didn't hear anything about that. If they lifted the ban, that's news to me. 
So let me know about that. Also, if you guys have any questions or, or comments, leave me a line or send me a video. This is a nice cigar. Take care. I'll probably be smoking this on my next video.